I'm Trisha Keen. Right now on your 13 Action News update, developing news near Sunrise Manor. Police say a young boy was found dead in a freezer in a home near Carrie and Lamb. According to police, the victim's sister gave her elementary school teacher a note that was written by their mother. The note reportedly said she was being held against her will. Police began investigating and found the body. They think it has been hidden there since December. The mother's boyfriend was arrested for open murder. Well, today, the commissioner of Major League Soccer, Don Garber, gave new insight into the possibility of bringing a team to Las Vegas. He told reporters that they hope to finalize a deal establishing a new Las Vegas team within the next couple of months, but says it's far from a done deal. This would be part of an expansion, bringing the MLS to 30 total teams. Well, after years without a Cirque du Soleil show, the production company is tumbling back to New York, New York with an all new production. It's called Bad Apple and tickets are now on sale. Here are some renderings of what the show will look like. Creators say they drew inspiration from New York City's rich music, comedy and nightlife scenes. The production includes a cast of 39 people. The first show is set for May 12th. Danny. A very cold start to our Wednesday morning temperatures surrounding the valley close to the freezing mark and wind chills even colder than this. The breeze does linger into the start of our Wednesday, so it will feel like we're in the 20s for a lot of the Las Vegas Valley. And we're do not done with the rain and snow chance just yet, especially for the first half of Wednesday. Chances are right around 30%. Again, nothing expected to stick in the Las Vegas Valley, but surrounding the valley, uh, we could see a, a few inches of snow in the mountains. This storm system will move on heading into Thursday, so the wind speed will calm down, but it stays really cold. Our highs almost 15 degrees below normal Wednesday and Thursday. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can always get the latest news at KTNV.com.